Hi guys, so welcome back to my channel. So in today's video we are actually doing something very very different. I'm trying to remember if I had ever done a cologne or fragrance collection thing on my channel. I feel like I haven't. Uh, although that's something that I'm really really passionate about and I like I have done it a lot on my Instagram actually and I have worked with a bunch of brands that I will talk about. But this video is not going to be my fragrance collection because I do have an extensive fragrance collection that is quite a lot and it's, some of it is actually not in this place too so I have to like gather them together which I'm gonna do it in a bit but today's video I wanted, I wanted to try a new brand that I haven't tried before because this is also like a brand that's available at Bed Bath and no not Bed Bath and Beyond but at Bath and Body Works, that place, yes, Bath and Body Works. Uh, so they always have like this, I feel like very luxurious and like picked items and brands that they have specifically and I love what they offer honestly. I even had like a hand sanitizer from them so it's, it was really really good. Uh, like it smelled amazing. So this time I'm actually trying this fragrance from CEO Bigelow uh, Barber. So they're actually a company that does a lot of things for men and uh, they're based in actually New York City. It's kind of like a pockery. Um, so they have a bunch of things that they have offered in their stores, also on their website. So I have actually heard of them before. So uh, it wasn't like new to me. But I didn't know honestly that they had fragrance. Uh, so I was very impressed that like they had that. So I wanted to try it out. So first thing first, first impressions. Uh, this smells and also, I'm mean, well, smells is gonna get into it. But this feels um, very luxurious. Uh, like the packaging and everything, it feels very uh, like manly. Like the color and everything. So it reminds me so much because I also have this fragrance with me. This is one of my favorites. This is Spice Bomb uh, from uh, Victor and Rolf. This is Night Vision. So I think they do have Spice Bomb, just regular one, which is from like I think for women, then okay. Night Bomb is for men. So I will talk about that later when I have to do the fragrance collection. Uh, so we are talking about this one. So this one is, yeah, it, it looks very like neutral, very manly. Uh, I love everything about it. That the packaging, I think it's pretty cool. So this, they have multiple versions of it. So I'm gonna read it to you guys. So uh, the one I purposefully chose is elixir blue but they have other ones like elixir white elixir black and elixir black pepper so i feel like i knew that black and black pepper are going to be very very maybe strong for me um or maybe it's, it might be too sweet like i i, I feel like i might have wanted to try black pepper because i do love uh like fragrances that are actually sweet although i have also gotten fragrance that are not sweet like this one so because black and black pepper version of this one has vanilla in it uh so that probably going to be like smell like very sweet and i like that actually but this one actually is very manly i wouldn't i would say it's not like unisex probably not it's very very manly so and i have gotten like compliments from it because like when i used this one for the first time it smelled i was like so impressed i really was because i really just thought like it's gonna be uh, like i didn't have high expectations to be honest but i was so so impressed like with how it smelled like um and because when i was reading a description that's why i ch chose it based on uh when they were because they were offering me the options and i was like okay let me see which one i want so when i looked at this one i was like this sounds like me because i am so adventurous and i do like i guess clean because it's refreshing adventures and clean because it is kind of clean because i feel like i would use this one not on a regular day but more on days that like when you're going out somewhere you're going to drinks or dinner uh stuff like that i don't think i would use this like on very casual casual days it's definitely meant for something like special occasions in my case i would use it so this one has aromatic watery marine notes, lavender, so it makes explains why it's so refreshing. And it also has rosemary. Um, that I was not expecting because I thought like I would hate it because I have had tried some uh, like fragrances that has rosemary in it. It wasn't my favorite, but I didn't really notice it personally. I was more hooked on the, the lavender. So uh, it also has like 
kind of like woody like i would definitely say wood uh undertone to it that's why i would say like it, it definitely feels like nature ish it reminds me kind of like tom ford in a bit because tom ford has like this nero or noro i will put the link here it's a very weird name it's mediterranean vibes this is like something like not exactly but slightly similar um and it also says like white mask like like with a clean hint like it, it's kind of like that it's hint of it i wouldn't say it's super strong but i remember i used this one uh the day that i was going to this event for the restaurant I think it was like two weeks ago or something I got a bunch of comments from people because some girl was like saying oh whose cologne is this whose cologne is this and I just thought like it was they were talking to someone else <laughs> I was like it must be you it must be you <laughs> then she looked at me like she's like no it's you <laughs> so I got like a bunch of compliments that day I was kind of like wow off topic like I didn't even know what to answer because I lost all my social skills <laughs> Anyways, I'm just saying I did get like really really uh, good feedback from it and uh, I wouldn't say like Like it stays too long like that or lingers It's I wouldn't say like that because after a while like once you use it it kind of like I would say it loses its scent like you can still smell it But it becomes like very subtle smell that I love absolutely because I think there's so many like uh, fragrances that like I have used especially the one from like aqua di parma they're like very famous for their fragrances uh, a lot of people like it i personally don't like it although i have worked with them before they're very specific ones that i like uh, they're very strong and it's just kind of not for me this is like i would compare this with so much with this victor and ralph like they both are slightly similar slightly similar i would say this one is more cleaner than this one this one is more peppery i would say this one's kind of like black pepper version so um but they're very similar in terms of what i like i would say that's why i like them both so much uh i feel like even when you look at it like their packaging i mean obviously this kind of like looks like a bomb but i meant like they're both very dark and like moody so what i'm trying to say is like uh, it is very i feel like they because of the price range it's definitely not super expensive it's 52 dollars uh i'm sure you can also find like a discount speaking of that i also have a discount code that they uh send it to me it's called merce allison i will put it right here uh so you will actually get 10 percent of your uh, co bigelow orders or any of the orders that you want from their website uh until uh june 1st so you can use that coupon code i'll put them in the description as well so you can check them out uh, but i'm just trying to say like you will definitely feel that luxurious feeling like luxurious smell of a cologne but without breaking the bank because there are so many luxurious brands that like they would be charging like over a hundred dollars for a fragrance so this is pretty decent deal and it smells really good so thank you cf bigelow for sending me this product and i'll see you guys next week with another video bye guys